I once read a story where two men approached a wise man to tell them about their fortune. The wise man told the first man he would be poor in life and then told the other he would be rich. The man who was told he would be rich went home happy and spent the next few days just sleeping and waking up, convinced he would be rich. The man who was told he would be poor was afraid. Out of fright, he started to work so hard until a few years down the line, their luck changed. The man who was told he would be poor became rich, and the man who was told he would be rich became poor. The moral of the story is, if you do not go to work doing the things that will make you successful, even though you think you're more likely to get lucky, you'll never become successful. One of the things necessary for success is learning skills that make for success. What is one skill you know that if you learn, you will increase your chances of success? Most people do not even know what success is as a skill, and there are success skills that attract success. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you three skills that you must learn or forget about succeeding. 1. People skill. The bulk of your success will involve people. If you don't know how to treat people, how will you succeed? I know businesses that have gone under, and some that are certain to go under because of the employer's relationship with the staff. Most successful people may have very obnoxious attitude. Walt Disney was known to have a bad temper. Still, lots of people love to work with him. The reason is simple. People love to work with persons of great vision. How skillful people are with others is often how successful they would be. Think about it. There is likely someone you know who always gets what he wants or always gets his way with people. Mostly not be taking them for granted, but by the way, he relates with them. He doesn't manipulate, but has an attitude that makes people always want to be around him. Most of us have people like that in our lives. We know such people, or we should be striving for such persons. If you suck at relating with people, read books on human relationships. I remember reading Dale Carnegie's book, How to Win Friends and Influence People at a time when I was really sucked at making friends. Just two chapters into the book, I was making so many friends and interacting with people with such a high confidence level. Listen to this. The depth of your people skill can automatically determine the height of your success because as you climb onto the top, you will always need people to prop you up. 2. Communication skill. I know someone whose only challenge in business success is his communication skill. This lack is seriously holding him back from making so much progress that he is capable of making. I often tell you about the time I was supposed to lead a team of highly intelligent people, but my English was poor. So, I resorted to reading so profusely that in less than a few months, I was speaking fluently and eventually led this team successfully. The thing is, if I hadn't communicated with these people at their level, there wasn't going to be any connection between us and commitment on their part. Communication isn't only about being able to speak the English language fluently, it is also much more about being able to say things precisely the way they ought to be said. So you move people into action. You can say in many words what you need to say and still never communicate a thing to anyone. Yet, you can learn to speak a few words and still communicate effectively with others. If you don't know how to say what you want when you need to, you will never be able to always get what you want. Hitler's eloquence and oratory skill were so great that it moved people to believe they were some supreme race. At a time when dejection was upon the people of Britain because of the war, Prime Minister Winston Churchill's oratory skill was so precise and touching, it helped people cling to hope against hope. Effective communication is also learned. It takes a whole lot of discipline to cut fluffs from your language so others can learn to understand you. If people always have to misunderstand you, you just may not have learned to communicate well. And one thing is sure, a man who communicates his vision clearly will succeed in moving people into acting upon the same vision. 3. Money Management Skill I put this last because this is perhaps one of the skills that most people lack. Billions of people all over the world talk so much about money, how they want to make money and grow money and have money and become rich. But very few ever learn how to manage money. And you see, it is the effective management of money that guarantees you will keep having more and more of it. Someone who cannot save and invest should never expect to succeed. Someone who cannot identify opportunities to go after it should not expect that money would come to him. If you are so concerned about spending all you have as soon as you have it, it's no wonder your money won't grow. Successful people, for example, invest back into their business what they have and they never live above their means. Effective money management is a mindset. With the mindset of the rich comes riches and with the mindset of the poor comes poverty. So, 
if you want to manage money effectively, you must ingrain in yourself the mindset of the rich. This is the mindset that constantly attracts riches and retains it for a long time. How well you manage money is how often and how much money will keep coming to you. I hope this video has helped you. If you love the video, subscribe to our channel. We love you.